Kathy Wood and ARK Invest just doubled down on their Bitcoin and crypto strategy. Kathy Wood has a price target of $500,000 for Bitcoin, so it's pretty important to see what she has to say, especially with her given track record with Tesla and many other companies. So in today's video, we're going to go over first ARK Invest price prediction. We're going to go over three reasons why they're predicting Bitcoin will reach this price and something that just came out within the last 48 hours where they doubled down on their crypto strategy. They made some massive investments. Now they have close to $2 billion invested in different crypto related products. So if you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to like the video down below, subscribe. And if you don't already have the public.com investing app, make sure to go ahead and follow me on that. You can buy stocks, sell stocks, and see exactly what I'm buying and selling in real time, as well as a full portfolio breakdown. Think of it like an investing app combined with social media. It is completely free to follow me. Use the code Michael when you sign up and you'll get up to $50 in a free stock. But anyways, Kathy Wood and ARK Invest continue to reiterate their massive $500,000 price target. We've talked about this $500,000 price target for a while for Bitcoin back I believe in October of 2020 was the first time she came out and spoke about it and the first time we did a video on this. But recently she came out and reiterated this price target and said just the other day that right now Bitcoin is massively on sale. Now that after the drop, she said people are getting emotional. So it's difficult to call a bottom with the recent crash and the recent volatility we are seeing. Right now we are seeing Bitcoin's price fluctuate between that thirty and $40,000 per coin range. We are seeing with Bitcoin, if you look at over the last three months, ever since we had that drop from about 60,000 down to 30,000, we have been fluctuating between 30 and $40,000 per coin. But that being said, right now, with regards to Bitcoin, she came out and said three specific reasons why she is still very, very bullish on Bitcoin, on crypto, despite what Elon Musk said, despite with all the scary, you know, the big fear in the market from China, banning Bitcoin mining, China, banning crypto transactions and any crypto related activities activities. She came up with three reasons to why she's still very, very bullish on Bitcoin and why she still believes it could reach $500,000 per coin. So the first thing is that Kathy Wood said that she believes Bitcoin can reach that $500,000 per coin range as soon as institutions start to put about 10% of their balance sheet into Bitcoin and into crypto. Because right now we are less, we are at such a small percentage in terms of how much institutions are putting into Bitcoin and into the crypto world. For example, the only companies that have money in crypto are really Tesla, Square, MicroStrategy, and some of the most innovative firms. But we don't see companies like Procter & Gamble. We don't see companies like um, we don't see companies like Johnson & Johnson. We don't see companies like Coca-Cola allocate any portion of their balance sheet, any portion of their investments into crypto. So this is surprising. We haven't even seen Facebook put money into Bitcoin yet as well. So once we start to see these Bitcoin and Ethereum ETFs approved, I think that's going to be when we start to see major institutional capital come into Bitcoin. And that's when we're, when we're going to start to see this very small percentage of institutions investing in crypto go from you know less than one percent up to ten percent down the road her second reason is with what is going on with the market cap of bitcoin right now bitcoin has a market cap of right around 600 billion dollars but that being said she said look at the idea of bitcoin look at the technology look at what it's trying to accomplish and compare that to what amazon and apple are trying to accomplish right now with a 600 billion dollar market cap um, Bitcoin is less than half the market cap of Apple, less than half the market cap of Amazon. And when you look at the idea of Apple, which sells phones, has, you know, a suite of products, a lot of technology. But when you look at the idea of Apple and you look at the idea of Bitcoin, or when you look at the idea of Amazon selling products online and you look at the idea of Bitcoin, Bitcoin has so many more use cases. She said it is such a bigger idea, a much bigger idea than Apple or Amazon, because it is, first of all, not only is Bitcoin a entirely new investment like asset class, but also the technology, the blockchain technology can reinvent the entire financial world from decentralized finance applications to smart contracts to digital wallets and many more. And the third thing that she did say as to a reason why she believes Bitcoin will continue to reach its $500,000 price target, like she has said, is because of what is going on with um, specifically, she spoke about this in her big ideas for 2021. And in this report, she explains how right now, 
you can see number four, five, and number six all have to do with digital currency, Bitcoin, crypto, and all of that in general. You can see number four is digital wallets. Number five is Bitcoin fundamentals. And number six is Bitcoin preparing for institutions. So we start to scroll down and we look at this report where she talks about digital wallets. Digital wallets alone is projected by Kathy Wood and what they're projecting with ARK Invest is predicted to be a $4.6 trillion opportunity. We're already seeing Apple start to enter this market with the digital wallet on the iPhone. But once we start to see like Venmo, cash app and all of these start to incorporate crypto and we start to see all of these crypto world in general is going to get much much bigger because people are going to have easy easy access to spend bitcoin to spend um ethereum at different locations right now it is not so easy to spend crypto at different stores not all stores accept it but once we start to see this trend change it will have a massive massive um increase in capital coming to bitcoin and ethereum so those are the three reasons why and lastly let's go over exactly her current strategy and a couple of big announcements that came out recently so first of all let's talk about what is going on with Kathy Wood buying more of different crypto investments. On May 20th, when we saw the entire market crash, she bought more Coinbase, plunged about a couple hundred million dollars into Coinbase. That was on May 20th. When the market crashed again, just the other day on June 23rd, Kathy Wood bought 1 million shares of Grayscale Bitcoin Trust. And she also bought about $50 million worth of Coinbase again. When we're looking at her entire positions, if we look right here, we can see that Kathy Wood and ARK Invest currently own, if we search up Grayscale Bitcoin Trust, GBTC, we can see that Kathy Wood and ARK Invest currently own $238 million directly of GBTC, which is, you know, basically follows the price of Bitcoin. It doesn't own underlying coins, it doesn't own the underlying Bitcoin because it's not an ETF, but it does follow the price of Bitcoin. That is the way they can get exposure to it due to regulations and so forth. In addition to this, they also own right now of Coinbase over $1 billion. When we look at Coinbase, they own $820 million of Coinbase in ARKK, which is their flagship fund. $200 million in ARKW, $100 million in ARKF. And you look all across the board, we can see that they own a significant amount of money in crypto related investments. Just about $2 billion when you start to take into account Bitcoin, um, Grayscale Bitcoin Trust, um, and all the other crypto related products they can have exposure to right now because of these regulations. But that being said, right now, Kathy Wood and ARK Invest have the three reasons why they're buying Bitcoin and Ethereum. Bitcoin and they believe in crypto. The one is because institutions are going to allocate a larger portion of their balance sheet. Just it's a matter of time. The second is with um, with the market cap of Bitcoin with relation to the market of Amazon or Apple and how much bigger of an idea Bitcoin is, yet it has a smaller market cap. And the third is with what is going on with digital wallets, people actually being able to spend it at locations once we start to see more and more businesses accept crypto. So those are the three reasons why every time we see a dip, we see see Kathy Wood and ARK Invest continue to pour more money into it. I'm buying it. I'm very bullish on it. But for all of these reasons, Kathy Wood and ARK Invest are doubling down on Bitcoin and crypto investments. And they think it is a great time to get in now, especially on these massive red days when we see the market have a bit of a correction and we see a bit of fear come out of China. It is a great time to get in because crypto, the technology behind crypto is not going away anytime soon. So it's just, you know, another opportunity to take advantage of. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please be sure to like the video down below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.